why am I attacking the Satanic Temple Part 2 of many. It's a very nuanced presentation I'm going to have to do. It's complex and I have to be careful with my words. More for you than for me. We've gotten a lot of email messages, direct messages, text about follow-ups, about the satanic beef sessions me and Stanton LaVey are about to unleash. And what I can tell you, what I can promise you, I've been shot. What I can promise you is that all will be known by November 2021. Unveil audio. I'm going to unveil texts. I'm going to unveil emails. And that... But we're at the thought experiment part of the game, I think, where you have to ask yourself, like, what's in it for me, me? What's in it for me to attack the Satanic Temple? How's that going to benefit me? Um, I'm not into it. I've been shot right in the fucking neck. Oh, I'm not into wanting to have people bother me. That means followers. I'm not into making friends, okay? I just make artwork. So how does this benefit me? How would it benefit me? How does it benefit me? Where do I get paid for this? What, am, where, what How does it benefit me? Is that only revenge? Certainly, that is something to strive for in your life, is revenge, when you have to have it. But what am I getting? What am I getting? I, am I getting a lot of love from Satanic Temple people? What do you think? No. And another question you should ask yourself is, what are you getting out of joining any group? What do you get when you join things? Do you get a free subscription to their magazine? What do you get? Is it only for identity? Do you really think you need a satanic group run by men? to deal with abortion rights? Or is it a smart marketing decision to put abortion rights in front of you to cloud that issue? Cloud the issues of your real political beliefs, the foundational beliefs. Now I will tell you something. There's a guy named Doug I know in my life. I know him probably better than most of you. I mean, there's probably a few that know him better than me now. But we spent copious amounts of time together. I know, I know this person is a very controlling person. He wants to control. He wants rules. He wants power. In a, in a perverse way. These are all words that are... We all have different understandings of them. Different definitions. Different... We relate to the words so differently. So it's easy to manipulate with words like power or anything like that. So it's, I want to stay away from that. I don't want to treat you like I would everyone in Portland. Like all I do is have to yell, he's a racist. And everyone's going to attack him without any thought, without any questions. And i got to tell you, part of the whole satanic trip is, is being a skeptic, being the adversary. You know, and I can't say it enough, but Satanists are just fucking nerds that look different. I think Stanton said it in one of our records. He said, I said, Satanists are nerds. He goes, yeah, that, that are fashionable. I would agree with that. So, so I want you to ask yourself those questions. I don't want to go on too long here. It's, I'm at the almost five minute mark. And again, I'm going to get harassed for it. You said a bunch of words, but they mean nothing. But I gotta, I'm asking you to answer the question. Why would you join anything? Is it for your identity? Is it because you've lost something in the in the in the in the in the in the, in the path that you've chosen? Vincent. That you need something else to tell you what you are? Are you lost? Are you without love? Understand the biggest best victims, the biggest best consumers, the biggest best customers are the ignorant 
and the poor. They're the fry cooks of the world. Just like Anton LaVey. Anton LaVey was a fry cook. Hello. Hello, baby. Hello, little baby. Look at this little baby here. Look at that little baby. Hello, little baby. This is a rescue from Costa Rica. You're kidding me. Well, what a beautiful Costa Rica. Stay tuned. Stay tuned in. Pay attention. Ask more fucking questions. Don't join cults. That's a, that's a hard no. Don't join cults. Don't be a soldier. Be a person like other people. I want to give you something else to think about. Now, you've seen that, if you go see that satanic film, uh, Hell Satan, this, satan this, this fake documentary, I want you to ask yourself, why would, why would this bozo put on a bulletproof vest at the end? Why would he do that? Is it to trigger your fear? Is it to poke at your PTSD? Is it to get you all riled up to be violent? To be an army? Satanists aren't, aren't like that. We don't, we fight with our mind. We'll kill you with our mind. We fight with our mind. We don't, we're not soldiers. There's a lot to fight. And I think we are in the forefront of fighting. But we pull back, go to the library, do some research. You know what I'm saying? So you got to think about why would this person put on a bulletproof vest? I never seen Stanton LeVay do that. I never seen all of my other satanic friends do that. I've never done it. I'm walking down the street of Chicago. There's a Mother Mary in every fucking lawn. It's, it ain't no doubt it's dangerous. But it's dangerous to be a Christian too. It's dangerous to be anything when you when you put yourself out there. You're, you're, when you say this is what I believe is going to change the world for the better. Don't give me no fucking grief about my time and how this is. I, I, I've, I've come to the understanding that I am now at uncle age. So you're going to be at uncle pace. I'm not going to fucking feed it up, speed it up for you. But so you got you, you just got to roll with the punches here. And uh, stick with me. There'll be there'll be little pieces of information in this. I'll try to do this more often. But I'm working on something for November. We're slowly building towards November. You got that? Come to Chicago in November. Pay attention in November. Listen to these messages. Give you little tips, little clues. Do some research. Do your work. Figure it out, have good questions, be skeptical, and, and come at us. Come at us in November. I'm giving you enough to research now. I know you got limited resources like we all do. It's going to take you some time to research this.